Hey everybody, how's it going? I got some good news for you. I just found a video that I had never released. I completely forgot about it. Filmed it in the uh, winter of last year, so it's a little off season since it's the dead heat of summer. But it's a pretty good one. My daughter Lindsay came along. It's a uh, instrument approach in the mountains with pretty significant icing in the Vail, Colorado. Figured you guys would enjoy it. So even though it's the summer now, I'm gonna go ahead and release this winter video a few months late. Hope you guys like it. <laughs> Can you hear me, baby? Uh-huh. Good. Can you hear me? Yes, I can. Do a couple more things here real quick. Are you videoing us already? Yes. Four flight 471, Adam Sky, runway 36, taxi to be Alpha. 36 to be Alpha, four flight 471. Taxi checks, exterior lights are required. Brakes are checked, nozzle steering is checked. Flight instruments, airspeed zero, one, two, three times, altitude drop and react, we're in FMS. Three, 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 pointing three, to the three, left. Two, one, Juliet. All right, everybody, welcome on board. We are headed out to Eagle, Vail, Colorado. They got a bunch of snow yesterday, so I figured I'd bring my little girl Lindsay along with me to see the snow in the mountains. We're just going to do a pickup, so we'll be there basically long enough to eat lunch, but it's a fun trip to get to bring her. Very, very grateful that uh, I've got such cool people I fly for that allow me to bring my little girl with me sometimes. Right, baby? Yes, sir. All right, so ride along here for the takeoff and the climb out, and uh, probably going to be pretty short on that. Most of the filming will be on the arrival and the approach into Vail. It's real pretty there right now. Four flight 471 Adams Tower, Romay 36, clear for takeoff, fly heading 320, wind 320 at 14, gust 19. Traffic is a King Air, three mile right base, Romay 36. All right, baby. Clear track 153, extend downwind, traffic Here we follow go. King Air, three mile right base, Romay 36. That is Extending downwind, looking for traffic, clear. clear track 153. Takeoff thrust is set and achieved, two good engines, airspeed's alive. B1, rotate. Hey, we did it! Positive rate. Gear up selected. Four hundred, V2 plus ten, no failure. Back to climb. Flaps are up, yacht amp, flight level change, lights go to recog, and we start our turn. Four flight 471, contact departure. Over to departure, four flight 471, good day. It's so beautiful on your side. Departure, four flight 471, 1700, climbing 4000, heading 320. Four flight 471, Little Rock departure, radar contact, climb and maintain 15000, clear direct to ABS. Climb and maintain 15000, direct to ABS, four flight 471. Direct to ABS, select nav. All right, we're good. We're in FMS. Flight level change, 222. Four flight, 471, contact Memphis Center, 128.47, great day. 2847, four flight, 471, good day. Three and clearance is void, if not off within 10 minutes. If not off within 10 minutes, by the center at that time of intention. And report departure on this frequency. Three, four, right, we're above 10,000 feet, point. recog like, come off, five, and now we can talk. Three, five, is correct, and hot springs, altimeter 3026. 2625, Delta, Center, four flight, 471, 1300, climbing, 15,000. Four flight, 471, and Center, Roger, good morning, climb, maintain, file 230. Morning to you as well, flight level 230. Uh, 122.7, right, we'll on. see him. All right, everybody. Well, we're on climb out here, getting up to cruise altitude. We got a ways to go still. About two hours and route to uh, Vail. Not much has happened, and the weather is beautiful. There's really nothing on the way. So I'm gonna go ahead and shut the cameras off, and we'll bring you back on for the arrival in the Vail. See y'all soon. All right, everybody. Welcome back on board. We're on descent into uh, Eagle County Regional Airport. We can uh, see the mountains now that we got out. You can see the uh, front range right here. We're over Denver right now. And then you can see all the mountains are in the clouds. So we are going to be doing the uh, LDA-25 there in the Eagle. I've got it loaded and I briefed it up already. But I will uh, show you guys exactly what we're doing. 1,000 to go. So yeah, we're doing the LDA-25 in the Eagle County. We'll go to uh, Kremlin, which is this VOR. Then we'll follow this route in, Quandry, Voaxa, Aquila, Weehaw, that'll line us up. Then uh, Eagle, Washi's the final approach fix. 
we can come down to uh, 8,330 feet, which is 1,790 feet above the ground. You usually don't get too low United to the ground in the mountains, and this is a good example of that, mainly because of a uh, missed approach requirements. Have a good day. So as you can see by this plate, one, one, one sec. 2865, 4 flight 471, good day. Center, 4 flight 471, flight level 270. 4 flight 471, Denver Center, advise information. Sierra, just going to maintain flight level 240. We have Sierra, just set to maintain flight level 240, 4 flight 471. Santo, All right, 240 set. So yeah, anyways, you can see on this uh, approach plate, we're going to be in the mountains pretty much the entire time. We'll be over them, and then we'll eventually descend down into the valley around the Aquila and Weehaw area. So we'll be ultra vigilant. Right now, information Sierra is saying uh, winds are calm, 10 mile visibility, overcast 5,500, temperatures minus 8, dew point minus 12, altimeter 3045. Like I said, down here we only need... Uh, basically 1,800 foot ceilings to get in. We've got 5,500 foot ceilings. So it shouldn't be too big of an issue. Areas of scattered moderate precipitation about here 11, 12, 5, 5 miles. That's the point route about the next 900 miles. Roger, thank you. He's referring to the snow. You can see the snow here on the center screen. And then out the window, you can see it as well. Those are some pretty uh, thick clouds. So there's quite a bit of snow in the mountains right now. And we can see some down below us as well. They're really pretty. Yeah, they are. You excited to see the mountains in the snow? Yes, sir. Denver Center, citation 325. Good. I love the snow. 10.2, climbing 15,000. I cannot wait to land. Did you know and Mommy go skiing off mountain? Yeah, we did in Vail. I'm going to show you a little bit of where we went. Can I feel the snow? Yep, you sure can. I wonder what they call snow snow. That's just what God said to call it. We come to this uh, airport quite a bit. I come several times a year, so I'm very familiar with it. The last time we came here, we actually did go mist. Uh, we had a mist approach in the mountains. It, the weather uh, on the way out, it deteriorated quite a bit. A lot of snow showed up. And it was right at minimums. We had plenty of fuel, so we decided to go ahead and try the approach. And uh, we just didn't break out. It was a, a blizzard at the time. And so we went missed, uh, which in the mountains is a serious endeavor. Everything went fine. And uh, we went over to Denver Centennial, sat for a couple hours till the snow stopped. And then we made it over to get our passengers where they needed to be. So everything worked out. But that's a uh, good reason to truly brief every approach anytime you're gonna do it, especially one like this in the mountains. You need to have a heightened sense of awareness anytime you're coming into here like this. Flight 471, descend to maintain flight level 190. Flight level 190, for flight 471. Six, take us, take us to your flight conditions on the descent and including any ice that you might have picked up. Uh, we're picking up ice here at 13-8, uh, we are minus nine and INC. Six, thank you. Six, thank you. Thank you, thank you. What's the type of icing and intensity? There we go. Path is captured. Flight level 100 zero set. Light rhyme. Six tango tango. Six tango tango. Thank you. Contact Eagle Tower 119 or point eight today. Going to Tower 198. Six tango tango. Have a good one. So that was uh, on the approach ahead of us. Sounds like we're going to get light rhyme icing, which is to be expected. You can see out front here. These are really thick clouds. Flight 471. It's cold. Uh, early report of moderate clear icing. Uh, one six thousand out of one two thousand. Uh, with a citation that's on the approach. Just a little relaxed now. I still think it's some light rhyme ice on the approach. Roger, thank you. 45471, thank you. Break, stop left turn 227, Denver Center. Uh, moderate, top of low fall 210. Right All right, we've got approach, Tango. Right Since now. we're clear for the approach, I'm setting VNAV right, to Washi, which is the final oh, approach fix, 9,800. We're going to VNAV all the way to that. Really, I could go all the way to minimums, but for now, since it's in the mountains, I don't want something to mess up and go lower than that. So I'm going to set that, and I'll probably lower it in the future. So we are direct to Kremling. Altimeter will be 3043. That is set. We're coming up on uh, 180, so I'll switch. 3043, Kremling, VNAV direct at 14. VPAT's back on. And we're just a little over 10,000 feet above the ground, so I'm going to go ahead and get the approach checks too. Come down here and calculate our landing data. Runway 25, predicted weight is 11,400 pounds. Load in the weather. That looks good. 
Landing configuration will be anti-ice on. So we need 3,386 feet. We've got 8,000. Field transfers off. Exterior lights are recog. Master briefing is complete. We're both buckled in. CNC pulse are adjusted. Secure pack safety is not needed. Messages are checked. Pressurization is working down. Approach checks are complete. I'm going to start slowing down. You uh, want to get on speed and configured early on these approaches anytime in the mountains. Aspen's even worse, but this is a prime example as well. The reason is because you're at higher altitude and it's harder to get the airplane to slow down. All right, Kremlin at 14. We're going to level here until after quandary. So we will uh, at six zero four two two zero. get a chance to reduce our speed a little bit here. All right, altitude capture at 14. Departure Gulf Stream 855 Alpha 10200, climbing via the SID. Uh, Turn on the windshield anti-ice and start melting the uh, ice off the windshield. 855 Alpha Denver Center, radar contact. LDA is preloaded. Not sure if you can see this. We've got what's called a ghost needle, a gray needle. I can see that the localizer will tune 109.75. That is correct. Our minimum speed in icing is 180, except on the approach, obviously. And uh, they don't want us to have the flaps or gear down any longer than necessary, so I'm going to hold off on all that. I'm just going to manage the speed for now the best I can. Not sure if you can see, but the uh, de-ice is kind of melting the ice finally. It comes off in streaks like that. Every CJ except for the 4 has bleed air to heat the windshield. The CJ4 has got electrically heated windshield. Center. I haven't maintained flight level 260. As you can see here, our top of descent is just after VOAC, so we'll start down again. 604 for landing of 300 vector for the LDA approach into Eagle. And we're on the approach. We were clear for the approach, like an arm approach. Say we're getting moderate rhyme ice. I'm not sure if you can see the line here. Everything on the outside is the unprotected area, so this is all the uh, ice we're getting. It's quite a bit of ice. All right, speed checks. We're going to go flaps 15, and we're about to start down again. Four flight 471, contact Eagle Tower 109.8. Over to tower. We had moderate rhyme. All the other conditions were the same. Four flight 471, good day. Eagle Tower, four flight 471, LDA 25. Four flight 471, Eagle Tower, report Washi. We'll call Washi, four flight 471. Engine 377, taken. Alright, there's our VPAP captured. Roger, contact me on tower for continuing to ready. Wings are still clear. Step 10, cross runway 25. You can see on our uh, synthetic vision here that we're in the mountains now. And we are descending down into them a little further. Touch bumpy here. I know from previous experience coming in here visually that there's a pretty good mountain range off to our left here. Pretty close. Alright, we haul out or above 12 2. Stab 10, Roger. Looks like we're breaking out now. There you go, babe. Alright, I've got the airport in sight. We do have quite a bit of ice on the windshield still, as you can see. Broke out at about uh, 12,300. I'll do the math on that later. This is an LDA, so it's offset. So the airport's uh, basically straight ahead, but the runway is angled away from us. We'll offset here a little bit and rejoin it correctly. Pretty, isn't it, sweetie? Uh-huh, the mountains are really high. All right, we're gonna go gear down, speed checks. Pre-green, no red. Speed also checks for flaps full. They're selected. Before landing yeah, checks, no, no. gears down through green, no red. Flaps are 35, speed brakes retracted, air speeds are posted. Autopilot to go. There we go, we're leveling at Washi to catch the glide slope. 
Auto I'm going to the rest of the way. 45471, Washi. 45471, runway 25, clear to land. Runway 25, clear to land, 45471. All right, glide slope's captured. We'll set our power about 55% N1, tends to be the correct power setting in this airplane. Ballpark at least. And since glide slope's captured, I'm going to set the missed approach altitude. 14.6 is set. Right. Minimum. Minimum. There's our minimums. Everything's looking good. I'm going to turn the anti-ice off for now. That way, down low, if we have to go missed, we'll get all the performance from the engines. And now that we're minimums, we can uh, sidestep okay, so since we're visual. Well, we can uh, continue alpha or across the ramp. And get in line with the runway, and I'm going to get onto the pappies instead of the approach guidance. Right there at the minimums call, that's how low we got into the valley the last time we were here uh, about a month ago and had to go missed. So it was uh, kind of a busy time. 500. Three green, no red. Flaps full, we're cleared to land. We're on the pappies. Speed is stable. I'm going to slow to ref now. God amps away before landings are complete. You go to our record 2347. We're back with you at the ice pad 2. Ready to continue to the runway. We have tango. Another beautiful landing as always. 45471, turn left when able, taxi parking Alpha Alpha 3, this frequency. Left parking Alpha Alpha 3, and stay with you, 45471. All right, baby, welcome to Vail. It's very pretty. I know, we're gonna get a rental car and we're gonna go explore, so everybody stay tuned and we'll show you some of the scenes of our exploring. I think we're gonna go to Vail Village, it's pretty neat. Go show my baby around Vail Village. Do we have to ride in the car around Bell Village, or do we get a go out and be free around Bell Village? Clear for takeoff. We can get out and walk. Take off 25, 2347. We got quite the uh, rental car here. I'm all right with that. I just booked the cheapest thing. Rental car status pays off. <laughs> Cold, huh? Through the blinds Wash away the worries Like a winding tide Yesterday Left far behind Your sweet scent Fills my lungs In the sun Light, troubles fade away with you. No need for words to say your love. The gentle breeze that carries me through. I give up the world, the moon, the sky. For you, I dream so. I hope you guys liked that video. We had so much fun. Lindsay decided she loved the mountains so much that we had to go back a couple months later for her first ski trip on her birthday, and she loved it even more. Your face in gold